Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. We're here today with a very special preview of the UNSC Mantis from Jazzware Toys. And this also comes with an exceptional figure. All of the footage today is from Halo Collector. Kevin Hurd is a dear friend of mine and Halo Collector is the number one place to talk Halo collecting on the internet. Let's dive into his footage today. He's going to break open this box and show us everything we need to know about the UNSC Mantis. And this set, you know, it really took me by surprise. I knew Jazzware was crushing it, but to announce such a massive vehicle on their second year, I really was impressed. And talk about impressed, we've got all these figures from the World of Halo scale, two packs, and even vehicles, the Gun Goose and the Shade Turret. Just outrageous. So look at the packaging, man. It looks beautiful. And Kevin will show you, it's, it's a little bit difficult to stand up at first, but when you see how much articulation goes into this thing, I think it's an easy sell. So first of all, we've got this Mantis. Just, just gorgeous, man. The amount of detail I can see already. Different colors running through. This brown perfectly contrasts with the dark black underbelly. And then these red highlights just make it pop. It, it's awesome, guys. Fully articulated legs and guns. An opening hatch and just so much more to offer. This thing has a gorgeous UNSC print on it, and then yeah, it, it reminds me so much of the RC Mantis that we got in Mega Blocks, but way, way more detailed, like not even close to the same scale. The toes and the legs, it all looks really well crafted, really well sculpted, and you just think about how much work went into just designing this one vehicle. It is actually very exciting to see not only for the potential that this vehicle has but the potential that this means for the rest of jazzware we're gonna get pelicans we're gonna get wraiths scorpions whatever we want it comes with a beautiful eva we'll show him off later and yes he fits inside that cockpit it's a little undetailed inside but it does the job and it's molded very well turned on its side we can see the articulation of the feet there pretty nice feature. I mean, I really thought when I saw the original image of this, the original box, I didn't think it would articulate at all. I thought it would be like the Mega Bloks RC Mantis, no articulation, but you can see there are three different swivel joints there. And the top of the leg there seems the most impressive to me on this sort of pivot between two different ball joints. It's very impressive, guys, and it will lead to a load of articulation. How much articulation you need on this kind of thing, I'm not sure, especially when you're just going to be displaying it, but it's still nice. You can see those guns, the missile pod just swivels around in so many different directions. It's actually crazy. It spins all the way around and articulates right out to the sides. And then we've got this chain gun. This is when I do think it would be nice if it was lights and sounds, but baby steps here. And we see there it's standing up pretty nicely now. I'm sure with more time and practice, you can figure out how to use those ball joints effectively, get it in its perfect positioning. And just the Mantis, it seems like it's going to play a big part in Halo Infinite. It was on the cover of Ryan Reynolds' Free Guy, the movie. I mean, it's gonna be a big deal. And let's talk about this EVA, just look at it. The amount of colors here, it comes with that gorgeous tactical shotgun. And it's really nice that with an expensive vehicle, you also get a highly detailed figure. I love those shoulders and so many different paint apps. Also, this is just the beginning, guys, of Jazzware Halo vehicles. I'm so excited for the future and thank you so much to Kevin Hurd at Halo Collector for the footage. We're going to be running down the Shade Turret tomorrow and the Gun Goose the day after that, so stay tuned for all your Halo collecting. Stick with the domain and Halo Collector.